hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we look at how we can install and also how we can uninstall software on a Kali Linux machine now we'll be doing the installation using the terminal I'm gonna open the terminal here now the first thing you want to do before you install software is it's recommended to up update your package repositories now the command to do that is a uh, sudo apt update press enter and then put in your password so in my case all packages are up to date so the other thing you might want to do is uh, upgrade your system you can do sudo apt upgrade dash y and in my case there's no upgrades to be done once you're finished with the update and upgrade you can uh, begin the installation of your software. Now there's different tools that you can use to install software. There's uh, apt get, there's, uh, so there's also other tools like snap, snapd or snap. And then there's also git, depending on if you're um, installing from source code. And there's also pip if you're installing uh, Python tools. So let's go ahead and uh, look at some of the commands you can use here. Now if I was uh, using apt, to install software I'll do sudo apt install and then the name of the package let's say for instance nmap I know nmap is already installed so that's how you would install it so this is the command to install a package is sudo apt install and then the package name now when it comes to searching for packages to check whether you already have a package you can do which and then the name say nmap you can also say sudo apt search nmap nmap and that will also tell you whether you have uh, nmap installed another command you can use you can you, you can check the version you can say nmap and then version that will usually tell you the version you're running now let's look at another tool for installing packages now if you're looking to install an external package let's say the name of the file ends with .deb you might need a different command for that so let's cd to the downloads folder and I'll do ls here I have a file here for Google Chrome and as you can see it ends with .deb to install this package the command is going to be sudo sudo dpkg-i and then the name of the package here Google Chrome stable current AMD and it's done and if I check my list here I can do Chrome and I have Google Chrome okay so sometimes you might try to install a package and you might run into errors. You can try to fix the errors by running this command sudo apt uh, fix broken install. And sometimes that can fix uh, errors. Okay, now when it comes to removing or uninstalling software, here are some of the commands you can run. You can do sudo apt remove, remove, and then the name of the package here. And then if you wanted to remove configuration files, you can do sudo apt page. And if you want to remove unused dependencies, you can say sudo apt auto remove. Now the other tool that I talked about was uh, git. Now this is uh, for source code. So if the software is uh, hosted on GitHub, or another git repository you can use git you can say git clone and then here you'll need to enter the repository URL once you have it downloaded you'll need to navigate to the directory and install your package using sudo make install finally we'll look at uh, pip so for Python tools if the software is a Python package you can install pip if it's not already installed and then use it to uh, install a python package so to install pip you'll do sudo apt install python python3 pip okay in my case it's already installed 
now once you, you have it installed and uh, you have the package name you can just do you can do pip 3 install and then the package name so those are some of the tools you can use to install packages on Kali Linux so I hope this information has been helpful I'll catch you in my next video thanks bye